Hi everyone! Today we're talking about fornication and bad decisions, or as this movie is going to call it, storks. What is that? <laughs> cool beans! You're probably asking yourself how a stork, a girl, and a baby wound up in this situation. I was not at all. In the beginning, storks delivered babies. <laughs> Lying to kids, because fuck kids. <laughs> Welcome to the seventh circle of hell. It wasn't always easy. No matter who, baby fat shaming. Now storks deliver packages for cornerstore.com. Oh, corner store. It's where I get my drugs too. Nice. Baby powder. Yeah, that's what I told the officer. No, no, no. Just a brief exposure to baby cuteness can ruin your life. Uh, no, that's not right. Ugh. Oh, wolf pack for mom. What is happening? Sorry. What? There is nothing about this movie that is scientifically accurate. If this baby finds her family, then maybe I can find mine. That makes no sense. Junior, you know why I built my office entirely out of glass, even though birds can't see glass? I do not. Power move. The bird owner of Amazon is a dick in this world, too. Aren't babies dangerous? Right, babies are dangerous, but why are babies dangerous? Hmm, well, let's see here. They've ruined your carbon footprints, they've ruined your sleep schedules, they've ruined your body, they've ruined your finances, they've ruined your man cave decorations, they've ruined your freedom to break up with somebody without guilt, they ruin, you know, your life, they ruin your wife's body, or your girlfriend's body, or your mistress's body, or some stranger's body that you faintly give a fuck about. They ruin your soul, they ruin your self worth, they, they ruin, ruin your teeth too seater car, they ruin your ability to have hands that don't smell like poo, they ruin your ability to hit on people, they ruin your fantasy football, they ruin your faith in God, they ruin your faith in the government, they ruin your ability to have any sort of confidence in your own ability to make life decisions, they ruin what taxes should be going toward, your ability to learn anything, they ruin your excitement for life, they ruin your trust in people, they ruin your trust in yourself, they ruin your ability to choose the cereals that you actually want that are healthy for you. They ruin your ability to put on R-rated movies. They ruin your ability to watch TV that doesn't suck ass. They, they ruin your parents' finances, and so on. This is a family that never got the baby they asked for. Just so you know, if you're a kind of person that wants to see this movie, I don't like you at all. We would triumph over adversity. Thank goodness we don't do that anymore.